Hey everyone, Josh here, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you some awesome new AI features within Wondershare Filmora. Let's have a closer look. So here we are within Filmora. I already have two clips loaded in, and the first AI feature that I wanna to talk to you about is the new AI translation tool. We can take any video, and transcribe it and translate it. So not only do we have subtitles in that translated language, but we also have the audio or voiceover. We have this clip right here, I'm gonna play it for you. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use AI color looks with masking. So as you can see, it's recorded in English. So I'm gonna have this clip selected, I'm gonna to go to the AI translation, we're gonna click on that, we're gonna select translate voice and text, then we're gonna go and select the source language, and I wanna translate all of this into Russian. We're gonna select auto match, so that way the timing lines up with the original video, and we're gonna click on try free. Give it a few moments, it's gonna upload it to the server and translate it. Once it's done, you'll see that it's completed right here in the task window. We can exit out of this, and then we can see what the AI translation tool did. So as you can see, it created the subtitles in that target language along with the voiceover. A great feature right there, especially if you're a content creator and you only have one YouTube channel, well now you can create several YouTube channels in different languages with just one video. Pretty cool, right? Okay, let me show you the next awesome feature, and that is the AI background removal. So we have this clip right here of this lady walking, and we're gonna use AI to cut her out from the background. This tool is especially useful for color grading and if you wanna isolate effects in different parts of the shot. So let me show you what I'm talking about. Double click the clip, we're gonna to go to Video, AI Tools, and we're gonna select Smart Cutout. I'm gonna click on this button here, a new window will pop up, and now I'm just gonna select the woman right here, and as you can see, it selects the subject very quickly. We're gonna click the tracking button, so it's gonna track her throughout the whole entire clip, and once it's done, we're gonna click save. Now it isolated her completely from the background. It looks similar to like that chroma key effect that we would use within green screens. Now let me show you how to really put this effect to work. We're gonna right click the clip, we're gonna to go to duplicate, I'm gonna place one clip up top, and this is gonna be our foreground clip, which is just the woman, and we're gonna have the background clip, which is just gonna be the background. So to re-enable the background, we're gonna double click on the lower clip. I'm gonna to go to AI tools and disable smart cutout. Now what we can do is we can separate the background effects from the foreground. So for example, I can add different tints in the color, vibrancy, disable the saturation to make it black and white, and I can even adjust the exposure and brightness. You can see how powerful this effect really can be, especially for those of you who love color grading your videos. And on top of that, you can also add different text elements and effects within Filmora too. Now let me show you how to create your own AI custom music that will fit your project perfectly. So to create your own music, all you have to do is go to the audio button, go to AI music, and in the tag combination, you can add different genres, so that way Filmora knows what type of music it should generate. You can also go to settings right here, you can select the tempo, the duration, and the music count. Those settings alone will completely change the mood of the music. Here are some songs that Filmora already generated for me. Let's have a listen. You can also scrub through the music right here by clicking on different parts of the waveform. There's this one as well. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna select the first one and just drag it onto my timeline. If you wanna use any of these music clips, make sure you download it first by clicking on the download button. Now when we play back our footage, we have that AI music generated and it fits really well with the overall theme and genre that you're looking for. So those are my favorite AI tools within Wondershare Filmora. I'm giving away a few free license codes for Filmora, so make sure you comment down below and tell me how you would use Filmora or any of these AI tools within your next projects, and I'll choose a winner by the end of the month. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in another video. Peace.